Hello everyone, Assalamualaikum. So here is the derivative of logarithmic functions. So the first formula here, we have differentiate ln x. Differentiate ln x, it is just 1 over x. Okay, 1 over x. Where is this x coming from? This is just literally from this ln x over here. And then times it with 1. Kenapa times it with 1? It is just because differentiate differentiate this differentiate x we will get 1 okay look at the second formula the second formula yang ini yang kamu kena highlight kan dia second formula ni sangat membantu untuk semua jenis function yang terdapat di dalam ln okay semua jenis function yang terdapat di dalam ln okay boleh di boleh di bila differentiate kan dia kamu akan dapat 1 over this 1 over, I think I want to make it bold lah. Because when I bold this, okay, I make it bigger and bigger and more bigger. Oh no, cannot too big. So I make this bold. I bold it because 1 over is always the same. 1 over with its function f, whatever the function, you just copy and paste. Copy and paste again, okay. Bahagian denominator yang kamu copy and paste, ya. Yeah? Bahagian bawah ni, dia mesti 1 over dahulu. 1 over uh, of the function di dalam ln. And then you must not forget times it with its derivative. Derivative dari mana? Yang dari f ni lah. Okay, they derive the function f, you will get f prime. You understand that, right? So this is how easy you differentiate the logarithmic function. Okay, sebab tu lah kamu nampak tadi 1. Where is this coming from? 1 is just literally coming from differentiate x. Sama kan dengan formula yang kedua ni? Yeah, they are totally the same. So, I am recommending yourself, uh, all of us, to use this second formula all the time. 1 over fx times with its derivative f prime. Let's go to the first example. The first example here is y is equals to ln 3x. So when we differentiate it, we will get dy by dx is equals to okay, 1 over whatever function inside of the bracket ln. Okay. Maksud saya apa-apa yang di dalam ln lah. Okay. So here is 1 over 3x. Okay. 1 over 3x. But you must not forget, times it with derivative, okay, times it with differentiate 3x. Okay, differentiate 3x is just, it is just 3. Okay, differentiate 3x, differentiate 3x is just 3. So, I don't want to write it down. I just want to write down 3. Okay, I know it's very easy to look. Differentiate 3x, it is just 3. Okay, you know that already. Differentiate the function f. And then, you solve it, you you solve it, and you will get your answer is just 1 over x. Easy. That's the most basic. Differentiate the logarithmic function. Let's go to the second example. So, before you trying to nak cepat-cepat tulis dy by dx, you kena ingat you ada square root. Square root tak senang-senang nak Nak, nak, nak kita terus solve. No, we have to do something about this square root first. We got to change it into something to the power of 1 over 2. Dari situ baru dah senang nampak macam mana nak differentiate. So, I got to change it first into bracket to the power of 1 over 2. Inside here is still 1 uh, x plus 1. Leave it like that. Just change the square root into something bracket to the power of uh, half. Okay. Dekat sini, you faham that you ada ln. Ln mempunyai, pernah dengar tak lol? Pernah pernah dengar tak the law of logarithm? Okay. This is where the law of log came into the rescue. Okay. It's going to rescue us and bring the power here in front of the ln. Hanya ln sahaja, hanya logarithmic function sahaja yang boleh diapplykan dengan ln. Okay, so now I'm going to put my y equal, y equal 1 over 2 ln x plus 1. Okay, I just bring the power down. 
Okay, sekarang ni saya tak differentiate pun lagi. Saya masih lagi dalam huruf Y. Still, still a Y because I haven't differentiate first. Saya belum lagi. Now, I'm ready. When I'm ready, I can now write down my dy dx. Bila dah ready je, baru letak differentiate. Differentiate dy by dx. Now I'm ready. One over two, just copy down. So now I put a bracket saying that I'm ready to differentiate. So this is one over x plus one. Differentiate ln x plus one. It is just one over x plus one times one. Okay. Can I put times it with one? Sebab differentiate x plus one. Okay. Remember. We must always differentiate x. Kita mesti sentiasa differentiate yang 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 kita punya function f. Remember the formula? The formula is 1 over f times it with f prime. Mana datang f prime? Of course, coming from here. Differentiate x plus 1, it is just 1. Setengah orang dia terus nampak dan dia tak nak tulis. Dia tak nak tulis and then... Dia boleh just tulis conclusion yang begini sahaja. Easy peasy. Okay. Now, let's move on to the next example. The next example here, you must look carefully. This thing, ln x, the whole thing to the power 4, is not equal to the ln 4x. Okay. No, it's a, it is not. Okay. This is not um, yang sesuka hati kamu boleh bawa power dia keluar, power dia dalam tidak, that is for the sine, cos and tangent, that is trigo now we are going to, now we are talking about logarithmic function logarithmic function tidak sama dengan trigo function ok, jadi jangan samakan mereka punya formula, jangan campur aduk, dia dekat sini ok dia dekat sini, the whole thing power 4 and dalam ni adalah ln x. So actually, if uh, I have done a lot of exercises, therefore I understand that I have to apply power rule. Because when I apply power rule, I can bring the power down. Okay, bring the power down and I will get n times fx, copy and paste, to the power of n minus 1 times it with its derivative of the function f. Okay. And so, what I'm going to do is just dy by dx. I am ready to apply the power rule. Okay, when I am trying to apply, apply the power rule, my 4 will come down and then I copy back. Ln x will be copy back in a bracket with the power of 4 minus 1. 4 minus 1 which is 3. Okay, 4 minus 1 which is 3. Okay, and then times it, differentiate inside of the bracket. Don't forget, differentiate di dalam bracket, iaitu f prime. So, we will get 1 over x. 1 over x. Therefore, I can simplify it. My answer is 4 ln x, the whole thing. Remember, the whole thing to the power of 3. Okay, this is ln x. And then everything here will be divided with x. Ta-da! That is how easy you apply the power rule. Just jangan senang tertinggal power lah, tertinggal derivative lah. Ah, ini yang budak senang callous. Okay, but but I really love the power rule the most. I, I hope you like it too. Because it is not that hard to apply. Okay, right? Now, kita ada dua function yang berbeza dekat sini. Satu linear dan satu lagi logarithmic function. So, kalau dua function yang berbeza didarabkan bersama, this is what we call as applying the product rule. Okay, applying the product rule, this is your u, this is your v. Therefore, when you are ready to differentiate, you, you put dy dx. And then you write down the formula v u prime plus u v prime. And then you terus masukkan your v. Your v is ln x. Put a bracket pun boleh. And then times it with your u. u. U prime, okay? Your u prime now is x. 
differentiate x which is 1 okay 1 and then plus it with plus it with who plus it with u u is x okay your u is back your u is x just copy it there while your v prime here your v is ln x therefore your v prime is 1 over x ah tulis je lah kena pandai nampak satu demi satu hati-hati kalau tak nampak tulislah ah di luar bahagian luar kertas guna pensel or something okay and then i solved it i will get ln x plus 1 just like that very very easy peasy okay so now example yang terakhir saya telah sediakan uh, penulisan di sini and i'm just going to explain this this is a bit harder it's not that hard um if you trying to terus differentiate terus cari g prime memang honestly is very difficult uh, nak pakai formula ni memang payah Tapi kalau ada peluang untuk pakai law, untuk pakai law of logarithm, setiap kali ada peluang untuk pakai law of logarithm, tolonglah applykan dia dahulu. Uh, applykan the law, the, the law, okay? Just apply the law first because here can be changed into this, log A minus log B. And then the power, all of this power can bring down Okay, apply lagi sekali and with another formula and see this is the most simplest, simplest gx. Now, this is the simplest function lah yang belum di differentiate, belum lagi. After you have got the simplest g, now you can find the g prime. When you are ready to, ready untuk, untuk differentiate, barulah you letak the prime. Okay, but ataupun dg dx. Uh, ikut pada kehendak kamu masing-masing pun boleh gx boleh g prime x boleh g dg by dx pun boleh sama sahaja okay so now when you are ready to differentiate yang ni kan lagi mudah lagi nampak mudah untuk differentiate betul tak so saya lagi lebih happy lah untuk uh, apply the law mesti apply the law kalau kamu tidak apply the law it will be very difficult to apply this formula uh, sebab for, sebab dia complicated it's quite complicated the function so if you have simplified it you are going to be feeling that it's very easy to differentiate ln x minus 2 which is 1 over x minus 2 times it with 1 differentiate x minus 2 is 1 okay and then minus with the second term 1 over 2 salin balik and then differentiate here differentiate ln ln x squared plus 1 which is 1 over this thing copy back 1 over mesti ada 1 over function f this one lah function kan ah, fx and then differentiate it differentiate x squared plus 1 it is just 2x and so you you expand it Okay, you expand it and you will get this part. But the thing is, this is not simplified. Selagi mana ada dua term, tidak simplest lagi. Nak jadikan simplest, mesti samakan denominator. Okay, samakan denominator. Bila dah samakan denominator, you gotta do some expansion. Dah samakan expansion, you do some amal apa? Uh, simplify it and, uh, and when you simplify it you will find out that this is x squared plus 4x and and there go here also can be factorized and this will be the simplest form that you would really really look forward to 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 having it sebab untuk chapter 9 memang kita sentiasa aim untuk dapatkan only one fraction bila ada one fraction itulah yang dipanggil sebagai um, simplest form alright untuk logarithm untuk derivative of logarithmic function setiap kali ada peluang untuk apply law tolonglah applykan dia